what is going on guys yet again welcome to another video this is Koso from the Koso mix youtube channel make sure you guys hit the notification so you guys know when i go live and make sure you guys subscribe and like the video so i'll go ahead and make more videos for you guys on everything that we love from games movies everything i am back to my normal self it's just gonna be a great channel so make sure you guys come in and enjoy the video other than that one day guys we have one day before the disney plus goes live and i got some crazy news here to let me know exactly when it's gonna go and they added a couple new other shows that uh it's, it's it's disney plus let's see let's see what it says so for months now we all know that the disney highlight highly anticipated streaming services disney plus will be launching in the united states on november 12th which is now just a few days away however what has remained unknown in all the time leading up to the service debut is exactly what time it will be arriving many assume that it will be like netflix original release strategies going online as soon as the clock strikes midnight on the west coast however it doesn't look as though that will be the case in disney plus so let's find out um in the in, in a move that may surprise you disney plus is launching a couple of hours after the sun comes up on tuesday morning so don't bother staying up all night to try to begin streaming before everyone else disney plus will become available at 9 a.m eastern time so everybody that's in the east florida new york georgia all the east coast nine o'clock will be going live you guys could start watching the mandalorian you guys could start watching all the marvel movie because they added endgame so you end captain marvel so you could right away just watch all the marvel cinematic universe in one place it's gonna be awesome it's gonna be awesome that means that uh, uh, a homecoming should be in there, I, I believe. I'm, I'm thinking, right? But let's see. Um, so remember, guys, 9 a.m. Eastern time. See right here, 9 a.m. Eastern time on a Tuesday. That time hasn't officially been confirmed in a Disney press release or anything like that, but the information about the time is more than trustworthy. Marvel official website, marvel.com, has added a countdown clock for Disney Plus, telling fans exactly what they can begin streaming their favorite Marvel movies. When you track the time remaining until the actual time, you end up at 9 a.m. Eastern on Tuesday morning. So, 9 a.m. I'm gonna be awake at 8 o'clock and 9 a.m. I'm gonna be doing the Disney Plus because I want to see what is going on because I am so excited I'm so excited I just can't hide it I know you like him yeah yeah let's see has there been uh Disney Plus I know there was another oh here it is this is the best the best part of this whole uh, thing is that disney plus adds more marvel studio titles for the release date all right so the launch of disney plus on tuesday is going to include more marvel studio titles than originally expected the slate of titles available on day one for the streaming services gained a half batch of movies on monday according to the official twitter feed the launch titles now include Captain America Civil War, Avengers Age of Ultron, Guardians of the Galaxy, Thor, Doctor Strange, Captain America The Winter Soldier, Iron Man 2, Ant-Man, Iron Man, Captain America The First Avengers, and Expanding the Universe. The movies join the rank uh, of an already stacked list of titles coming to Disney Plus at launch. From Iron Man to Endgame, see the newly announced Marvel Studios titles that will be available to stream starting tomorrow on Disney Plus. See, this is this is say um, 
It doesn't really say. Let's see. Marvel Studios series coming to Disney Plus. Other titles coming to the streaming services include Iron Man 3, Captain Marvel, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, and The Avengers. Each of these titles will be available at launch. And But it says 12 a.m. Eastern on Tuesdays. That's pretty confusing. I don't know uh, if it's gonna be 9 a.m. Eastern time or is it gonna be 12 a.m. I think that the the title will be available at 12, but I think you can start streaming at 9 a.m. There's only one way to find out is when we go tomorrow and find out exactly what time can we start streaming. Upcoming Marvel Studio projects includes Black Widow on May 1st, 2020. That that's going to the movies. Uh, the Falcon and the Winter Winter Soldier in fall of 2020. The Eternals on November 6, 2020. Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings in Feb 12, 2021. WandaVision is coming in 2021. Loki is in spring of 2021. Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness on May 7th, 2021. Spider-Man 3 on July 16, 2021, and then the What If in the summer of 2021. Hawkeye will be in the fall of 2021, and Thor Love and Thunder on November 5th, 2021, and then the Black Panther 2 on May 6, 2022. Marvel Studios Disney Plus series without release dates include the Miss Marvel, Moon Knight, and the She-Hulk. That is wow. They don't really have too much on the Disney Plus. Um, let's see if, if they have anything on the Disney Plus website. Um, there's a and there's okay, so there's there's a couple of, of, of good uh news here. Disney Plus announces new titles about its $12.99 bundle with Hulu and SBN. So if you are a big uh, sports fan and you like Hulu because of the content that Hulu has, um, you could get Disney Plus, Hulu, and ESPN all in one bundle for $12.99 a month. That is pretty much a real good price. Um, if you think about it, it's almost the same price as having Netflix, um, but you get three channels, um, uh, three streaming services all in one. Um, I'm not really sure if they're going to have, because I know that, uh, Disney plus has like the $6.99 a monthly, but with the streaming, with the streaming service of Disney plus Hulu and ESPN, it would be interesting to see if they have, I don't know. I will pay $8.99 if they just bring me like Hulu and, um, let's see. Existing Hulu subscribers. You are not eligible to purchase the bundle if you subscribe to Hulu through Spotify. But if you subscribe to Hulu pursuant to a promotion, unless explicitly permitted by the terms of your promotion or advice allowed by Hulu or Disney, if you already have an eligible Hulu subscription purchased through or received from Hulu or any third party other than Spotify, when you purchase the bundle, you may keep and manage that subscription. You will continue to be billed by Hulu or such third party that currently bills you at for the Hulu subscription. Let me see. Um, I think maybe later on, hopefully later on, they're going to come out with a bundle just for Disney Plus and Hulu. Because, um, I, you know, I'm not a, a big sports fan. I do like some sports, but I'm not a big sports fan. So I wouldn't want to get a bundle if I'm not going to use one of the streaming services. I'd rather just go ahead and get the Disney Plus and Hulu. Makes sense. Um, let's see if there is. I don't care about the bundle. Come on, people, give me. Okay, so endless entertainment. This is and this is. I went to the Disney Plus uh, dot com and endless entertainment. Get the best of Disney, Pixar, Marvel, Star Wars, and National Geographic. Download any TV show or movie. Unlimited downloads on up to ten devices, so you can take your favorite with you. 
no add-ons no upcharge it's 6.99 a month or 69.99 a year with no ads yo disney plus already got me like just by that we have uh exclusive disney plus originals never before seen movies tv shows documentaries and more from the world's greatest storytellers only available on disney plus we have what the mandalorian lady and the tramp disney noel high school musical the musical series hero project the world's according to jeff goldblum encore into the unknown making of frozen 2 monsters at work Timmy Failure, Mistakes Were Made, WandaVision, Falcon and the Winter Soldier, The Clone Wars, What If, Loki, and that's not even yet. We have 30 seasons of The Simpsons. So, keep me updated. 13 hours, 18 minutes, and 6 cents for right now. I could, and if you go to the Disney Plus, it will give you updated if you press the button at the bottom. This is just some of the stuff. I mean, it's not even telling me like everything that's going to be there. So I can't wait to see what they're actually going to bring in the Disney Plus channel. Wow. That is just incredible, man. Disney Plus is going to take the streaming services to a whole new level. I mean, they you, you're going to have everything that you pretty much love from... Star Wars to Marvels to Disney movies to animated movies to everything in there. They're all coming to the Disney Plus. That is crazy. That is super insane. I can't wait for Disney Plus. All right, guys, let me know. Are you guys excited for the Disney Plus? What is the most anticipated show that you guys are waiting for the Disney Plus? And... Which bundle are you? I, I'm just getting the Disney Plus by itself. I'm already a founder. I, I did it right away. I'm just waiting for it to go live and download the app and go into and watch Disney Plus because I'm definitely going to be watching The Mandalorian. So do stay tuned because I will give you a review, non spoiler review on The Mandalorian when it comes out. So, you know, wait for that. Um, but Disney Plus is coming hard. Hope you guys enjoy make sure you guys hit the subscription hit the notification comment down below are you guys excited for disney plus show which is a show that you guys um want to see um the most anticipated show that you guys want to see for all those star wars fans i know it's the mandalorian for the marvel fans i don't know they have like five six uh, I'm, I'm actually more interested in the moon Knight show than anything else um I would like to see what kind of twist that they're going to do to the Moon Knight show besides all the other ones that we know that are coming. But you know what to do. Hit that button. And we'll see you guys later. Peace.